Every year, attacks from dogs leave thousands of workers with injuries, some so severe, as we'll see, that workers are unable to return to work. Yet those attacked on private property find themselves ineligible for any compensation. Shonka Guha catches up with the campaign to reform the Dangerous Dogs Act. Alan, can you tell me exactly what happened on the day of the attack? This leg has got some nerve and some muscle damage to it now, hasn't it? Yeah, and this is after a skin graft, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, that, that's a skin graft. There is no recourse in law to protect our people, and we want that changed, along with a number of other faults within that, uh, within that legislation. Eighteen months ago, David Cameron himself, in writing to myself, gave us a, an assurance that he would change the law. We want them to deliver on those assurances so that we'll be protected right across the UK against those, who have, those irresponsible owners who allow their dogs to attack people and at the moment can do so with complete impunity.